All right, so I'm going to put this thing to the test tonight. It's already been fully charged. We were running off of just the solar for the most part. We're using this machine here. These are about 500 bucks. This is the old version. I don't know if you can still buy them. Uh, it's 300K, 24 volt, but it has a really wimpy solar charge controller. And so far, I can see it's actually pretty good value. Um, screen goes blank. So, okay, we've been declining on our solar for well, quite some time. I would expect. Okay, it shows what the inverter is putting out. About 600, because it reads it in kilowatts, 0.6. So it's about 600 watts, which is normal for that particular air conditioner. And that's 5 amps, which is what it's rated at. Um, tells me the input to the battery in kilowatts. The output of the battery, it's outputting 27 amps to run everything right now. We have apparently 35 volts of solar and no amps and no kilowatts so um, no significant anything basically so we're gonna see how long this will run the 5000 BTU let me go back down here. So, according to my chart here, and this is for the last year's Amper Time, which is now called Lie Time, but they're the same company, the same battery. Um, I'm probably going to get another one of these. Anyway, uh, they got a nice little chart in here. I really like. The only thing I like about like is this is like uh, really good for new people or people that can't remember things like me. So the state of charge, and of course you you cannot really guess what the state of charge is right now. If I turn it off, it won't be 25.9 volt fire. Um, 27 volts is 100 percent, and then about 50 would be 26.2. 26 would be 30 percent 25.8 would be about 20 so we're a little over 20 percent left if we were to go off of that number but because we're under load the actual number would be higher what it will do is it will disconnect at 21.6 volts because that is what I've set it for I might have even set it even higher than that I would have to go into the menu and look but uh, so we're going to test this. We'll run it until I've completely depleted the battery and just kind of see how long can you run a 5000 BTU window air conditioner in the middle of summer. So, um, using a $500 all in one inverter. So, here we have this is a $500 inverter. We've got a cord here. I don't know what that noise was. Apparently, this. Okay, the cord here, we got 14.2 Romex going to an outlet, going to our cord. Um, you got battery wires, which should be two gauge, but I'm using six. Um, they just recommend two. Six should be able to cover 100 amps. I haven't seen it pull more than 100 amps. I think if it did, you'd probably burn this thing up. So I think you're safe on that. Um, you really don't, a lot of these, you really don't want to use the max. We have some 8 gauge wires here, and then we have um, a old 12 gauge power cord going to our 6 panels that are hooked to it right now. And I know that's not the way to do it, but I am out of stuff. I've got all this over here hooked up. So, um, I need some more 10 gauge PV wire, and I just don't have any. I have to wait for it to show up. So, we're 25.9. Um, 
We're not really putting out any kind of power. It's not indicating. And we're pulling 26 amps from the battery. So that's what I'm saying. So we're pulling 26 amps. The 6 gauge wire is totally capable of 26 amps at 24 volts. Even at 12 volts it would be fine. But anyway, you can look that up for yourself and figure out how you want to do it. But So we'll, we'll get this tested. We'll see. And um, I'd like to get like, you know, a few more of these. To be honest, uh, see if I could um, wire them up to make 240 volts. I think you can. Um, this green one you can, but I don't think you can buy that anymore. So, and I don't feel like it's worth $700. So, um, I want another one of these. I want to get a bunch of these. If I get a bunch of these, I could do a lot of stuff. I don't want to be messing around with these old lead acid batteries. So, anyway, I'll post up the results on this later and uh, let you guys know how long did it go.